Squirrel is based on a character by Melanie Watt. Just ten more days. Can you believe it? I can't believe it. Nine days left. Whoop de doo. But silly me, what are you doing in eight days? Because I know what I'm doing. In eight more days. Eight. Seven. 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 Six more. Five. Four. Until what? Until we go! Yeah! You're gonna have to help me out. Paddle ball camp, our first year ever. We leave tomorrow. Ah, that's what that was for. What's that one for? To remind me what the first string was for, and this one's to remind me what that one was for. This reminds me to buy more string. Well, paddle ball camp is gonna be awesome! One whole week, nothing but the pee ball. I am so ready. For what? Ah, uh, Scary, I don't think you're gonna like this bus. Dave, please, as if I'm not prepared. Wow. Oops, almost forgot. Nothing's going to stop us from having the greatest paddle week of our lives! Yeah! <laughs> Come on, say it with me now! Paddle! Ball! Paddle! Ball! Go! <laughs> they always blame the skunk. I told you to crack a window. Scaredy meet Paddle Ball Camp. Paddle Ball Camp meet Scaredy. But what? I want the happy camp. Maybe you were holding it upside down. Hi, friend. Want a lollipop? At least the campers are friendly. If a bit unsanitary. But we're here to Paddle Ball, right? Right. And nothing's gonna stop us, right? Uh, you gonna eat that? All right, campers, pull in. This is it. It's starting! Okay, you little ankle biters, this is Paddle Ball Camp! Woohoo! The first rule of Paddle Ball Camp, no cheering! Woo! Seems a bit harsh. The second rule of Paddle Ball Camp, you do not talk about the rules of Paddle Ball Camp! Do you understand? Yes. Trick question. Phew! What is that? A paddle ball. You know, for a paddle ball camp. Chip, take it away. Is that really necessary? It's just the saliva. <gasps> Give your head a shake. You are not ready to play paddle ball on the first date. But it's called Paddle Ball Camp and everyone wants to play. Paddle Ball! Paddle Ball! Go! No, 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 no! <laughs> uh, wasn't me. Okay, calm down. Calm down! No, we demand to play. Yeah! Okay, okay, but first, we gonna sing a little song. Champ! <whistles> camp is good, camp is fine. We'll do what we're told in a single fine line. Good. Now follow Chip to your cabin. Camp is good, camp is fine. We'll do what we're told in a single fine line. What? No! They're being brainwashed. Do you believe this? Well, do I was told that it's like a fire line. What? The beat moves me. Stay with me, man! Camp is good, camp is fine. We'll do what we're told that it's like a fire line. No! Mmm, the will is strong in this one. I'm putting you in the junior cabin. What? I'm not wearing a helmet! <laughs> The pamphlet
it said clean cabins, and I'm not sure this... Uh, is this the only bunk left? Come to think of it, this, this one seems kind, kind of homey. Not so bad. Ew. Uh, what's going on up there? I spilled my drink box. I'm going to choose to believe that. <laughs> Attention, campers! Your day of lame activity starts now! Okay, first day's over. Paddle ball, here I come. Everything's coming up. Yeah! <laughs> Steve, can you believe what happened yesterday? God. <laughs> ah! Brave, 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 brave! But I don't see what this has to do with paddle ball. Ah! Pay attention, Lake Scum. Chip is gonna demonstrate a wildlife bird call. But paddle ball? You, squirrel, caca, go! <sighs> Hold on, hold on. Let me try that again. I'll forget it. We'll do what we're told that it's a fire line. What? What do you want? Ugh. Not exactly the dinner of champions. I think uh, I'm dieting. Squirrel run off to. He still thinks he's gonna get to play paddle ball. Ha! If we had to use the camper's money to buy equipment, I couldn't afford these. I couldn't. I couldn't. What? Come on, he'll show up by campfire. It's the only heat they get in this awful place. Ha ha ha! I'll show them paddle. Brave, 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 brave! <laughs> You're coming with me, Mr. Paddle Pants. We've had just about enough of you. You're giving the other campers um, ideas. I know what you're up to. All I know is that if you pull one of your little paddle tricks again, you're gonna get locked up. Where? Where will I get locked up? I was hoping you'd point somewhere else. Long shot. I know. You do what you're told in a single file line. And no more paddling. Uh, I guess this is it. I'll never get to paddle at paddle ball camp. <sighs> paddle ball up. Sit ball. No! I will not get brainwashed! I'll show them a paddle they can't ignore! Ah! Did you spill your drink box again? Yeah! Drink box! Everybody come down here! They can't stop us! <laughs> You can't stop the paddle in my heart. Try me. <laughs> Hope you like your new cabin. Cabin's <laughs> good, cabin's fine. We'll do what we're told in a single fun line. Hey, Scaredy, don't move. <laughs> Breathe a little. I'll never be able to beat those counselors on my own. That's it. I won't do it on my own. Come on. Come on. Come to Scaredy. Everybody, 
scaredy things coming up scaredy. What are you numbskulls doing? deprive you of your natural born right to play paddle ball a paddle ball camp. Well, I say, no way! No way, I say! I was on a stinky bus and then BAM! I'm the boss of a paddle parade! This camp is awesome! Yeah, we should definitely come back next year. That's just 364 more days! I'll remember for sure! Hey, what's that dripping on my head? What do you mean a drink box? That don't make no sense! Oh, brother. Or hug that tree in the park? Let's let the weather decide. Yay! <laughs> Nothing but sunshine. Hmm, but for how long? <laughs> Speculator Atron says clear skies, but I should make double sure. Salt's not clumping, that's a good sign. But there's no harm in being triple sure. <laughs> Sunshine, 23 degrees, 5 kilometer an hour winds out of the north, and 14% humidity. Okay, then. Just one last thing to check. Balsa All Weather TV with Dan Duck. Why didn't we do that first? Nothing but sunshine today and light winds that are almost as warm as my smile. Just sun, sun, sunny sun, sunshine. Hug that tree it is. Wait. Two warm fronts are about to meet. Maybe they already know each other. 83.6% chance of freak afternoon showers! And since there's nothing else to say, you lucky people get to watch me strut. Dan! No! No! No one in Balsa will be prepared. We have to do something. Does this thing do karaoke? Hey! Prepare for rain, Balsa City! So, nothing but sunshine from the weatherman you want to be, me, Dan Duck. Rain! Get rain! Warm front! Warm front! Rain! Hurry, Balsa! Find an umbrella! Bring in your laundry! And uh, get inside if you're wearing suede! Go! Move now! Nothing but sunshine, folks. I don't know who that was, Dirty but... Squirrel! I'm your number one fan. I even have your junior weatherman card. Step on the sunscreen, folks. From my bill to your ear, there's no rain. But, Dan, it's gonna rain. Look! 83.6% chance of rain. Are you going to believe, huh? That guy? Or gorgeous, gorgeous me. Now, where were we? Who does that crazy squirrel think he is? Yeah, Dan Duck is our weatherman. Weatherman. Hope it don't rain. These shoes are made of soap. The only way I know how to get back home is to follow the chalk line I drew on the sidewalk. This isn't here. I just painted my head. Dan, please, just look at it. Tell you what, Squirrel, if it rains, oh. you can have my job. But Dan... Said it, meant it, don't regret it. Hear that, Balsa? If it rains, this what? Squirrel is your new weatherman. <gasps> Dan, you of all people should know that the weather can change like... <laughs> about that. I can't believe it. I know. I'm the new weatherman. What? No, that's not the... I can't... Oh, fine. Dan, wait. Will you sign this for me? <laughs> All right. It's about time we were on TV. And as the sunlight causes the groundwater to evaporate, the moisture rises in the air organizes... Why 
change! Stop trying to change the channel! Stop trying to put me to sleep! Can't you make the weather more fun? The weather isn't entertainment. It's information! Boring. <clears throat> Cold fronts produce stratocumulus cloud formations, causing drizzle. In Norse mythology, thunder was also known, making the probability of precipitation higher in elevated areas, which is why they call it a UV index. What am I doing wrong? Your ratings are down 38% among housewives and 12% among crustaceans. We can't lose points in either of those demographics. What? I don't know. People liked it more when you were all crazy about the weather. Oh, so I have to wave my arms around and run in circles looking panicked, yelling, Drizzle! Drizzle, run for your lives! Ah! Wow, maybe you're right, Dave. Maybe the weather needs to be informative and entertaining. Informtainment! Yeah, informtainment. If that's what it takes to keep us informed, then that's what I'll do. If the sun will shine or the wind will blow, check with Scaredy, I'll let you know. Where'd he go? Great show. Yeah? Was the dark side grind across the lightning rod too much? Nah, just look. The more you turn up the crazy, the more the crazies turn up. Scaredy, Scaredy, I'm a cloud. Get it? <laughs> See? <laughs> Very Creative. You got fans now. <gasps> They're not fans of me, Dave. They're fans of the weather. This is awesome. Let's give them a show. You got it. And now the squirrel you've been waiting for. He puts the loud in cloud, brings the celebration to precipitation, the professor of weather, Scary Squirrel. Thank you, Dave. You actually made people excited about the weather. Nothing but clear skies and sunshine. Dangerously clear skies. <laughs> you get sunscreen, you get sunscreen, you get sunscreen! <laughs> if the sun will shine or the wind will blow, check with security. I'll let you know! I love your show! Uh-huh. Entertaining. I think you mean informtaining. I do an impression of you. Drizzle, drizzle, run for your lives! Ah! Bang on, totally bang on. She should be all right. It was raining cats and dogs, and I stepped in a poodle. Hmm. Like I always say, if it looks like rain, fella, better bring an umbrella. If you've got a barometer in your purse, I'll give you this emergency rain poncho. How about you, barometer? How about a snow shovel? <laughs> Another successful day of informtainment. Hey, if tomorrow's nice, we should go play hug that tree. Dave, we just did the forecast. You know what the weather's like tomorrow. Right. It'll be cloudy and sunshine at the quite cold as storms. I never listen to the weather part. Well, I'm sure everyone else is listening. Thunderstorms tomorrow will be... Oh! He's talking about me! No, I'm, I'm talking about real... Sheep! 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 Accordion sheep. solo! Sheep. Guess you guys missed the weather show, huh? I said it was gonna rain. We saw it. When did you mention rain? Was it before or after you danced in the strobe lights dressed up like a lady? I was supposed to be Mother Nature. Oh, we just remember the dancing. Here he comes. Scary! Scary! You ready to kick it, Scary? We're about to receive a record rainfall that is going to flood Balsa City. Wow, when you say that, the crowd is going to go crazy. There's no time to go crazy. They need to sandbag the river. So what do we do? This has to be our best show yet. Here's the guy who knows the sky. Scary Squad! Now, this is real danger. Danger! Danger! Stop doing that! Danger! Danger! I'll get their attention, Scatty. Kill it! 
big rainstorm heading for Balsa City. Where are the prizes? The massive rainfall will cause the river to overflow. When it does, Balsa will flood. To save the city, we have to... Act crazy? No. Well... We have to sandbag the river as fast as possible. Time is very... He's trying to trick us into learning! Don't you understand? Understand! <laughs> This rain won't stop for five days. Balsa City's gonna flood. Okay. Yuna. Yeah, baby! <laughs> but, but what happened to the rain? Sun, sunny sun, sunshine. I want my job back, squirrel. You can have it. It's Scary Squirrel Safety Corner. Scary's in a corner and he's safe. We're outside today to learn about camp safety. Rule number one, always be prepared. It's a tent. It's a dining room set. It's a unicorn. Voice check. Huh? Get in line. Not me. I've got a certificate. Lice free since 1992. See? Prepared. We're not removing lice. We're giving it. Just to be fair. Sweet acorns. It feels all pickly. <laughs> hey, did you bring a scratching stick? No, I did not. 